Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A group of people is standing in an office. B. Construction workers are having a meal at a work site. C. Several people are walking through a market. D. A man is reading a book in a cafe. The correct answer is B. Construction workers are having a meal at a work site. Number 2. A. People are sitting around a table. B. A woman is running on a treadmill. C. A man is reading a newspaper in a coffee shop. D. A man is typing on a laptop at an airport. The correct answer is D. A man is typing on a laptop at an airport. Number 3. A. Two people are riding bicycles in a park. B. Several people are cooking in a kitchen. C. A person is giving a presentation in a conference room. D. A man is reading a book in a garden. The correct answer is C. A person is giving a presentation in a conference room. Number 4. A. A man is giving a presentation to a group. B. A group of people is attending a meeting in a conference room. C. A man is typing on a laptop while a woman is observing. D. Two co-workers are discussing a project at a desk. The correct answer is C. A man is typing on a laptop while a woman is observing. Number 5. A. A man is walking through a park. B. A woman is writing equations on a board in a mall. C. A group of friends is watching a movie. D. People are checking out at a supermarket. The correct answer is B. A woman is writing equations on a board in a mall. Number 6. A. Two people are walking along a beach. B. Several people are having a conversation in a park. C. A man is working on a laptop in a cafe. D. A woman is speaking to a group in an office. The correct answer is C. A man is working on a laptop in a cafe. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Did you hear about the new policy change? A. No, I don't like coffee. B. Yes, it was announced yesterday. C. I work here. The correct answer is B. Yes, it was announced yesterday. Number 2. How long have you been working here? A. No, I don't. B. I'll start next week. C. For about three years. The correct answer is C. For about three years. Number 3. Who will be presenting the report? A. It was handed out last week. B. The manager will. C. It's in the report folder. The correct answer is B. The manager will. Number 4. Where should we have lunch? A. Let's try the new Italian place. B. It's at noon. C. I'm on a diet. The correct answer is A. Let's try the new Italian place. Number 5. How often does the team meet? A. Every Monday at 10 a.m. B. We had a meeting last week. C. I am not on that team. The correct answer is A. Every Monday at 10 a.m.
Number 6. Can you tell me the time? A. It's half past 3. B. It was on my desk. C. I'm attending a meeting. The correct answer is A. It's half past 3. Number 7. Have they confirmed the meeting time yet? A. No, they haven't. B. I checked the schedule. C. We met last week. The correct answer is A. No, they haven't. Number 8. Would you like some coffee or tea? A. Tea, please. B. I prefer soda. C. It's too early for coffee. The correct answer is A. Tea, please. Number 9. Who is responsible for the payroll this month? A. No, I haven't seen it. B. I usually walk to work. C. It's Andrew's responsibility. The correct answer is C. It's Andrew's responsibility. Number 10. What time does the office close? A. I usually leave early. B. It closes at 6 p.m. C. Workloads are heavy at the end of the day. The correct answer is B. It closes at 6 p.m. Number 11. How do I operate this machine? A. I can show you later. B. Please read the manual first. C. It should be delivered soon. The correct answer is B. Please read the manual first. Number 12. Is this your first time here? A. It's on the table. B. Yes, I would like one. C. No, I've visited twice before. The correct answer is C. No, I've visited twice before. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Are you planning to attend the training session tomorrow? Yes, I am. Will you be there too? Yes, I wouldn't want to miss it. Let's sit together. When is the training session? A. Today. B. Next week. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is... C. Tomorrow. Number two. Can you send me the latest sales figures? I'll email them to you right after this meeting. Thanks. I need them for my presentation tomorrow. No problem. When does the woman need the sales figures? A. By tomorrow. B. Next week. C. Today. The correct answer is... A. By tomorrow. Number 3. Are you attending the conference next week? Yes, I have already registered. Great. I'll see you there then. Looking forward to it. When is the conference? A. In two weeks. B. Next week. C. This week. The correct answer is B. Next week. Number four. Can you send me the sales report before the end of the day? Absolutely. I'm just finishing it up right now. Great. I'll look for it in my inbox later. You'll have it by this afternoon. When will the sales report be sent? A. By the end of the day. B. This afternoon. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is B. This afternoon. Number 5. I need help with my computer. It's not turning on. Did you try rebooting it? Yes, but it still doesn't work. I'll come over to check it out. What problem is the woman facing? A. A login issue. B. The computer won't turn on. C. A software issue. The correct answer is B. The computer won't turn on. Number 6. Have you spoken with the IT department about the software issue? 
Yes, they said it should be resolved by end of day. Good. We need it working for our presentation tomorrow. When will the software issue be resolved? A. Next week. B. Tomorrow morning. C. By end of day. The correct answer is C. By end of day. Number 7. Have you reserved the conference room for the training session? Yes. Yes. It's reserved from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. Perfect. Do we have all the materials ready? Yes. Everything is set. What time is the training session scheduled? A. From 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. B. From 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. C. From 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. The correct answer is A. From 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. Number 8. We need to move the client meeting to a different time. I suggest the afternoon. All right. I will inform the clients about the change. Perfect. I'll adjust our schedules accordingly. When will the client meeting be rescheduled to? A. Morning. B. Afternoon. C. Evening. The correct answer is B. Afternoon. Number 9. Can you cover the customer service desk while I'm at lunch? No problem. I'll be here until 2 p.m. Thanks. I'll be back by 1 p.m. Enjoy your lunch. Until what time will the woman cover the desk? A. 2 p.m. B. 3 p.m. C. 1 p.m. The correct answer is A. 2 p.m. Number 10. The client meeting is set for next Monday. Can you attend? I'm available in the afternoon. Perfect. It's scheduled for 2 p.m. I'll be there. When is the client meeting scheduled? A. In the morning. B. At 2 p.m. C. At noon. The correct answer is B. At 2 p.m. Number 11. Could you cover for me at the reception desk during my break? No problem. How long will you be? Just 20 minutes. All right. See you then. How long is the woman's break? A. 30 minutes. B. 20 minutes. C. 15 minutes. The correct answer is B. 20 minutes. Number 12. Can you finalize the report by Friday? I should be able to, but I need the data from John first. I'll remind him to send it to you by the end of today. Great. That will help a lot. What is the woman waiting for to finalize the report? A. Data from John. B. Approval from the manager. C. Feedback from a client. The correct answer is A. Data from John. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Welcome to the annual food festival. Today you can savor cuisines from around the world with over 50 food stalls. There are also cooking demonstrations and live music throughout the day. Make sure to follow the schedule for specific times of events and enjoy your day. How many food stalls are there at the festival? A. Over 50. B. 20. C. 70. The correct answer is A. Over 50. Number 2. Good evening, listeners. This is a public service announcement regarding water conservation. Please be mindful of your water usage. Simple acts like turning off the tap while brushing your teeth and fixing leaks can make a big difference. Thank you for helping to save our precious resources. What are listeners encouraged to do? A. Replace all plumbing. B. Use water carefully. C. Increase water usage. The correct answer is A. Use water carefully. Number 3. Attention shoppers. 
Our store is offering a special discount on all electronics this weekend. From laptops to smartphones, you can find incredible deals. Hurry, the sale ends on Sunday night. When does the sale end? A. Saturday night. B. Monday morning. C. Sunday night. The correct answer is B. Sunday night. Number four. We're excited to announce the opening of our new science museum. Located downtown, the museum features interactive exhibits and educational programs for all ages. Group tours and field trips are available by appointment. Come explore and learn. Where is the new science museum located? A. In the suburbs. B. Near the airport. C. Downtown. The correct answer is A. Downtown. Number 5. Please remember to water your plants three times a week to keep them healthy. Ensure they are placed in an area with plenty of sunlight, but avoid direct afternoon sun. Check soil moisture before watering to prevent overwatering. How often should you water the plants? A. Three times a week. B. Five times a week. C. Once a week. The correct answer is C. Three times a week. Number 6. Please note that this building is a smoke-free zone. Smoking is only allowed in designated areas located outside. We appreciate your cooperation in maintaining a healthy environment for everyone. Where is smoking allowed? A. In the lobby. B. Anywhere in the building. C. In designated areas outside. The correct answer is A. In designated areas outside. Number 7. Welcome to our annual charity auction. All proceeds from tonight's event will benefit local schools and educational programs. Thank you for your generous support. Let's work together to make a positive impact. Who will benefit from the auction proceeds? A. Local businesses. B. Animal shelters. C. Local schools and educational programs. The correct answer is A. Local schools and educational programs. Number 8. Join us this Saturday for the city's annual cleanup day. Volunteers will meet at Central Park at 9 a.m. and receive all the necessary materials. Let's make our city cleaner and greener. Together, we can make a difference. What time should volunteers meet at Central Park? A. 9 a.m. B. 10 a.m. C. 8 a.m. The correct answer is B. 9 a.m. Number 9. Ladies and gentlemen, the next train to Boston is scheduled to arrive in 15 minutes. Please remain behind the yellow line until the train has come to a complete stop. If you require assistance, there are attendants available on the platform. What should passengers do while waiting for the train? A. Stand close to the edge. B. Ask for a ticket. C. Remain behind the yellow line. The correct answer is C. Remain behind the yellow line. Number 10. Welcome to our museum. We have new exhibits that showcase ancient artifacts and modern art. Please ensure you do not touch any displays. For guided tours, check the schedule at the information desk. What should visitors not do in the museum? A. Take photos. B. Ask for a tour. C. Touch the displays. The correct answer is C. Touch the displays. Number 11. Hello, this is an announcement from the City Library. We have extended our weekend hours to better serve you. We are now open from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. on Saturdays and Sundays. Please take advantage of our new hours to enjoy our resources. What change has the City Library made recently? A. Added more books. B. Changed the membership fee. C. Extended weekend hours. The 
The correct answer is B. Extended weekend hours. Number 12. Good afternoon, everyone. We are pleased to announce the opening of our new library wing. It features a state-of-the-art reading area and a variety of new books. Please join us for the ribbon-cutting ceremony at 2 p.m. What time is the ribbon-cutting ceremony? A. 3 p.m. B. 1 p.m. C. 2 p.m. The correct answer is B. 2 p.m. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, we will finish the work. Friday. A, on, B, by, C, at, D, and tell. The correct answer is B, by. Number two. The documents. Before the deadline last week. A. Submitted. B. Were submitted. C. Should be submitted. D. Have been submitted. The correct answer is. B. Were submitted. Number three. The company has expanded its operations. It, it, 2010. A. In. B. On. C. Since. D. 4. The correct answer is C. Since. Number 4. If it ish, will cancel the outdoor event. A. Rained. B. Will rain. C. Has rained. D. Rains. The correct answer is D. Rains. Number 5. His busy schedule, he found time to attend the meeting. A. Because of. B. Despite. C. In spite of. D. Although. The correct answer is. B. Despite. Number 6. I'm looking forward. Your response. A. To receiving. B. Receiving. C. To receive. D. Receive. The correct answer is A. To receiving. Number 7. They're considering a new marketing strategy. A. Implement. B. To implement. C. Implemented. D. Implementing. The correct answer is D. Implementing. Number 8. The meeting. By the time they showed up. A. Had ended. B. Was ending. C. Ended. D. Will end. The correct answer is. A. Had ended. Number 9. The meeting. At 10 a.m. yesterday. A. Starts. B. Will start. C. Starting. D. Started. The correct answer is D. Started. Number 10. The manager insisted. Holding the meeting on time. A. In. B. 4. C. 2. D. On. The correct answer is D. On. Number 11. We are. Finish the report by Friday. A. Planning to. B. Planning. C. Plan. D. Plans. The correct answer is A. Planning to. Number 12. They discussed. 
A new office location. A. Opening. B. Open. C. To open. D. Opened. The correct answer is A. Opening. Next up is Part 6. Reading, text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Dear Ms. Clark, we are delighted to announce that you have been for the Employee of the Month Award. Congratulations, best, the management team. A. Nominating. B. Nominates. C. Nominated. D. Nominate. The correct answer is C. Nominated. Number 2. Hi, team. I would like to remind everyone that the meeting has been. Please check your calendars for the new date and time. Regards, Sarah. A. Reschedules. B. Rescheduling. C. Rescheduled. D. Reschedule. The correct answer is C. Rescheduled. Number 3. To all staff, the office will be for maintenance on Friday, so please plan to work from home. Best, facilities department. A. Close. B. Closing. C. Closed. D. Closes. The correct answer is C. Closed. Number 4. Due to the high demand, the product is currently we apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. A. Unavailable. B. Availability. C. Available. D. Unavailable. The correct answer is D. Unavailable. Number 5. Kindly note that the invoice for your recent purchase is Aussi. Please make the payment within 30 days to avoid late fees. A. Attaching. B. Attached. C. Attach. D. Attachment. The correct answer is B. Attached. Number 6. The new project manager has a wealth of experience in the field and is expected to significant improvements to the team's workflow. A. Brings. B. Bringing. C. Brought. D. Bring. The correct answer is D. Bring. And finally, Part 7. Reading. Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear readers, we are excited to launch our new monthly newsletter featuring company news, employee spotlights, and industry trends. The first issue will be sent out on January 15th. Stay tuned. Regards, the editorial team. What is the purpose of this newsletter? A. To promote a sale. B. To feature company news and trends. C. To announce layoffs. The correct answer is B. To feature company news and trends. Number 2. Dear Team, please be reminded that the annual performance reviews will commence next week. Make sure to have all self assessments and reports submitted by Friday. We look forward to discussing your progress and goals for the upcoming year. Best, HR Department. When will the annual performance reviews start? A. This Friday. B. Next month. C. Next week. The correct answer is C. Next week. Number 3. Dear Valued Customer, We want to inform you about the new loyalty program launching next month. You will earn points with each purchase, which can be redeemed for discounts and exclusive offers. Join now to start accumulating points right away. What is introduced in this message? A. A new loyalty program. B. A store closure. C. A price increase. The correct answer is A. A new loyalty program.
Number four, dear investors, we are excited to share that our third quarter financial results have exceeded expectations. Detailed reports will be available on our website next week. Thank you for your ongoing support. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To introduce a new team member. B. To share information about financial results. C. To announce a new product launch. The correct answer is B. To announce a meeting. Number 5. Exciting news. Our new product line, featuring eco friendly materials and innovative designs, launches next Monday. Check out our website for early access and exclusive offers. Be among the first to experience products that are both stylish and sustainable. Join us in making a positive impact on our planet. What is the main idea of this message? A. Closure of the company. B. Discount on existing products. C. Announcement of a new product line. The correct answer is C. Job openings available. Number 6. Dear team, please be informed that our weekly meeting has been rescheduled to Thursday at 3 p.m. due to scheduling conflicts. Kindly make the necessary adjustments to your calendars. Apologies for any inconvenience caused. Regards, HR Department. What is the purpose of this email? A. To notify about a change in meeting schedule. B. To cancel the weekly meeting. C. To announce a new team member. The correct answer is A. To notify about a change in meeting schedule. Number 7. Hello, team. We are excited to share that our company has been nominated for the Best Workplace Award this year. This nomination recognizes our commitment to fostering a positive and inclusive work environment. Let's continue to work together, C, to achieve great things. The management. Why was this message sent? A. To announce a nomination for an award. B. To introduce new team members. C. To inform about a policy change. The correct answer is A. To schedule a team meeting. Number 8. Dear valued customers, we are thrilled to announce the launch of our latest product, the Smart Home Security System. To celebrate, we are offering a 10% discount on all pre orders made this month. Visit our website to learn more and place your order today. What is the purpose of the announcement? A. To announce a sale. B. To announce a website update. C. To announce a new product launch. The correct answer is C. To announce a store closure. Number 9. We are excited to offer a new line of organic skincare products starting next month. Our new collection includes face creams, serums, and body lotions made from all natural ingredients. Stay tuned for special launch promotions. Thank you for your continued support. What is being launched next month? A. Electronics. B. A new fashion line. C. Organic skincare products. The correct answer is C. Household items. Number 10. Dear employees, the annual team building retreat will be held at Lakeview Resort from October 10th to October 12th. Participation is mandatory for all departments. Please register by September 25th. Best regards, Human Resources. When will the team building retreat take place? A. October 10th to October 12th. B. September 25th. C. July 15th to July 17th. The correct answer is A. October 10th to October 12th. Number 11. Dear colleagues, our office will be undergoing renovations from August 1st to August 15th. During this period, please work from home and ensure you have access to all necessary files and tools. Thank you for your cooperation and understanding. 
Best regards, facilities manager. What is the duration of the office renovations? A. August 5th to August 20th. B. August 1st to August 15th. C. July 20th to July 30th. The correct answer is B. September 1st to September 15th. Number 12. Dear clients, we are excited to announce our year-end gala dinner taking place on December 20th at the Grand Ballroom. Enjoy an evening of fine dining, live music, and dancing. Please RSVP by December 10. Looking forward to celebrating with you. Best. Event planning team. When is the gala dinner? A. December 10th. B. December 15th. C. December 20th. The correct answer is C. December 20th. Number 13. Reminder. The deadline for the submission of travel reimbursement forms for the last quarter is approaching. Please submit your forms by the end of this month to ensure timely processing. Late submissions may not be reimbursed. Ekel. When should the travel reimbursement forms be submitted? A. By the end of this month. B. End of the next quarter. C. Next week. The correct answer is A. Immediately. Number 14. To all customers, we are thrilled to introduce our new seasonal menu featuring fresh and locally sourced ingredients. Visit us today to try our special dishes and enjoy a unique dining experience. Cheers, the culinary team. What is the new feature mentioned in the announcement? A. A new seasonal menu. B. A new loyalty program. C. Extended business hours. The correct answer is A. A new seasonal menu. Number 15. We are pleased to announce that our company has won the Best Workplace Award for the third consecutive year. This achievement reflects our commitment to providing a positive and productive environment for all employees. Thank you for your hard work and dedication. What accomplishment is being celebrated in this announcement? A. Winning the Best Workplace Award. B. Launching a new product. C. Meeting the annual sales target. The correct answer is A. Winning the Best Workplace Award. Number 16. As part of our ongoing commitment to sustainability, we are launching a new recycling program company-wide. Starting next week, recycling bins will be available in all common areas, and employees are encouraged to recycle paper, plastic, and aluminum waste. What is the company implementing? A. A new dress code policy. B. A new recycling program. C. An extended work hour policy. The correct answer is B. A new recycling program. Number 17. Dear team, our quarterly performance review meeting will be held on July 14th at 10 a.m. in the main conference room. Attendance is required as key updates and future plans will be discussed. Please be punctual. What is the date of the meeting? A. July 14th at 10 a.m. B. August 14th at 11 a.m. C. June 14th at 9 a.m. The correct answer is A. July 14th at 10 a.m. Number 18. Notice to all staff. The cafeteria will be closed for renovations from October 1st to October 15th. During this time, complimentary meals will be provided in the conference room. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and appreciate your understanding. Best. Facilities Management. When will the cafeteria be closed? A. From October 1st to October 15th. B. From October 15th to October 30th. C. From September 1st to September 15th. The correct answer is A. From October 1st to October 15th. 